Just a day in the park. Just a day in the park. Shields up! Right now we are in a civil rights struggle to save white people from ethnic cleansing which is happening across the western world. Our monuments are being torn down, they are being removed and replaced, and our people are being torn down and replaced. What's going on here? We are about to march over to a, a, a statue with our torches and sort of make our presence felt in the most peaceful manner possible, but some of us are on the outside in case other people don't want to be peaceful tonight. We cannot allow our political opinions to be stifled by criminal acts of violence, and if the only way that we can stop that violence is to defend ourselves, then I'm going to play a part in that. We are carrying the torches as a march down to the monument here. Uh, we are going to hear Richard Spencer speak in a minute. I, I, I'm a fascist myself, so I'm not really allying with them. Um, I am one. Something that unites us all is that we believe that white heritage and white culture is something that's vastly important and worth fighting for. Jews will not replace us! 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 Don't fucking get in the formation. Stay the fuck back. Stay the fuck back. Can't well. Okay, you okay? you know what? I'm gonna stand right here face to face okay? with you, you well, pussy. Get over here. Come on. Well. Come back with the rules, can't well. Start to keep an eye on that fucking ass. Fuck this fight. Got ya. Blood and soil. 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 No Nazis. No KKK. No fascist USA. No Nazis. No KKK. No fascist USA. So we were marching um, from this pit down there all the way around the campus and up to the statue of Jefferson. Um, we had a leak, Antifa found out. Um, we also had to involve the police, uh, so the police were there, uh, but they did not separate us. So when we got there, the Antifa were at the statue. So basically it was us marching through the campus with torches and ending up at the statue where Richard Spencer was to give a speech. It turned out to be a brief speech because the police broke it up in the end because of the brawls that broke out.
Okay, so Chris Cantwell got maced out here. That's fucking crazy. Really? Yeah, I'm looking for you, Vice. You better watch out. I'm gonna gas your ass. What, what kind of inspired you to come out here tonight in general? Um, just like the craziness in the media. Like, you know, it's like here we are, just just fighting for our, our basic right to exist. We have open borders. You know, it, it, cultural Marxist universities. They're teaching multiculturalism, and 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 you know. It, the economy's fucked. Everything's fucked up. And and if we had a homogenous society, things would be a little bit better. And so, you know, it, if I'm not allowed to just say that I'm proud to be white, then there's an issue. At this point, it's far beyond Trump. Uh, and Trump, yeah, we all support him as the leader who is in office and who is pushing an agenda that we all support. But even after Trump, this will still be around. Kill all Nazis! 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 I don't let no Nazis turn me around, turn me around, turn me around, and I don't let no Nazis turn me around. you can do so much for a fucking master race what the fuck is that about but From over here on this side, and they started pepper spraying that direction. Right. You know, and we got. They were trying. Richard Spencer was here. They were trying to get Spencer, but I took a big fucking face full of it. What's the dynamics of what's happening on the ground there? Right. So uh, the right wingers are permitted to be up in the park, which is, which is up in this direction. Uh, mostly the anti the anti fascists, the clergy, the militia, kind of all the people who aren't loosely affiliated with Unite the Right are out on the street. The problem is, obviously, it's not like they, the right wingers to be airdropped into the middle of this. So they have to go through the left wing to get in, uh, and that's where they've predominantly been attacked. The left wingers aren't really uh, gaining any ground on the actual hill, but but they're able to attack them as they come in. Just a day in the park. Just a day in the park. Shields up! To my knowledge, no arrests have been made. Police are circling above, above in helicopters, but have mostly remained at the periphery of this uh, and between the two organizations up on the park. Uh, but, but as far as kind of brawling in the streets, cops are kind of letting it happen.
just went into my fucking, like, my neck. What can you describe about what's happening there right now? So uh, since the last time we talked, basically what happened is that uh, before, as I was describing, the Unite the Right rally was very separated uh, from the left wingers. There was kind of this attacking as the right wingers entered. Uh, the barrier was completely compromised, uh, which allowed the uh, uh, all of them to kind of be in the same area. And that was when really extreme violence started happening. Uh, there was one individual that I captured on my live stream uh, pulling out a handgun uh, and pointing it at the, um, at the left wingers twice. Uh, a lot of fighting with flagpoles and shields, uh, pepper spray used by really all three sides, the left, the right, and the cops. Uh, and since then, the police ended up taking the entirety of Lee Park, uh, declaring it an unlawful assembly. And I've, and I've just heard that, the, uh, that Virginia has declared a state of emergency. The militia has been um, much more involved directly on the ground, issuing first aid and trying to keep the protesters apart. The police really haven't been able to put themselves in between the two sides very much. They've kind of popped in from the periphery and they're trying to keep uh, a, a structure, right? They're trying to keep territory that they're that they're evacuating everybody from, but they're not getting in the middle of this. A lot of these are veterans who are here to protect our men, and they go behind cowards oh. throwing rocks. Stay late, stay late. Right here. Who's the medic? Got a medic right Wake here. Up. Watch my back! A lot of crazy shit today, though, bro. We're not denominational within the group. We're not here to protest. We're just here trying to maintain order. I fucking choked on my timber lands and I cracked my head. I could hear it crack. Oh, uh, it's craziness, that's for sure. There's yeah. really no order down here. We, uh, I was down at the main event since 8 o'clock this morning and it was pretty calm and relaxed for about the first two hours or so. Then uh, a lot of other groups showed up protesting. And bricks, rocks, and bottles of water started getting thrown. I had a gas mask on a few times and tear gas was flying. 
and they see the police jumping over the barricades and everything trying to get out the streets where there were several brawls. But here in this situation, we were, uh, we were simply, well, got to cut it short, we're moving. Let's follow the ranks. You guys are going to kind of need to move. We're fixing to drive. That's up. That's up. Uh, about one block ahead of me right now is uh, the National Socialist Movement uh, banner. Um, so the basically, National Socialists are um, walking across the streets of Charlottesville now. They attempted CPR, uh, and I had reported it at the time on my live stream that it looked like they had given up on, on CPR. Uh, it was about an hour later that the mayor confirmed that, in fact, she did die. Oh, my God. 
sit down when all should be standing? And why do we back down at the critical moment like a running away from the waves of the ocean? We head for the hills with the high tide approaching as sand slips away from the castle. Yes, I'm 